Good morning. Here we are on the Missouri Hang. For once, I don't have to drive 8, 9, 10, 11 hours to get to a hang with Hammock Forum members. They are uh, just about an hour and a half south of my house at the uh, Bell Mountain Wilderness. There's about uh, eight, eight or nine of us for, uh, for this hike. Uh, for this hang, so it should be a uh, great time. The uh, the weather is supposed to be uh, in the 50s during the day and uh, 30s at night, and uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful sunny day to start out. So as you can see this is Missouri in the late fall, early winter. Lovely. Hardwoods, brown, all around good time. Some great uh, mossy rock formations. We'll see a lot of this here in this wilderness. Good old Missouri granite for this part of the state, covered in a uh, lovely green moss. Trail, a little muddy. This is actually uh, part of the Ozark Trail that uh, I was going to do this summer. So the Ozark Trail runs right up to Bell Mountain and then you break off on the uh, Bell Mountain Loop. So it'll be about six miles to the top of Bell Mountain this morning. First little rise. Shedding clothes already. <laughs> yeah. One of the uh, lovely Missouri balds. It's like some nice granite. Hey, a little rest stop. This is uh, where some of the guys uh, spent the night last night. And uh, we just all stopped here for a little lunch break and have them uh, tear down their tents. But uh, it is a lovely spot. and uh, continues to be a great day. Well, we've arrived. Uh, I'm gonna turn this uh, camera around and you're just not gonna believe the view you're gonna get of central Missouri and these woodlands. Are you ready? Okay. Check out this panorama view. couple other people uh, lagging behind, but uh, hopefully they'll catch up here uh, pretty soon. Lots of daylight left. It's only about, uh, I think it's 1.30. Yeah, 1.50. So uh, lots of lots of daylight left. We'll, uh, we'll take some more video later this afternoon. Look at the view I have from my hammock. It is spectacular. I'm now standing at the highest point on Bell Mountain. Evening dinner time, about 30 minutes before sunset. Mm, actually, less than that, 20 minutes now. Taking so advantage of the natural amphitheater here at the edge. <laughs> of the abyss. Call Domino's, send us a pizza. Yeah, send us up a pizza. <laughs> it's getting to be a beautiful evening. It's kind of hard, though.
Good morning, and look at this spectacular sunrise from the top of the world. down to 28 degrees last night and we're up for an absolutely beautiful sunrise. On top of Bell Mountain. Truly the best view of any hang. One of the best views I've had. Reminds me of waking up uh, in the Grand Canyon, in the Smoky Mountains, in Zion National Park. It has really been exciting this morning to watch the sun come up. Morning around the campfire. I know it's crazy, but for me, the best part is just having coffee in the morning. Like the evening. Everybody getting ready to pack up, move on. It's not bad hanging out. Having breakfast. A uh, very successful hang. Bell Mountain, November 2012. Well, everybody has broken camp and uh, gone to do their own thing. Some uh, back to the parking lot. Uh, some are going to do some off-trail uh, bushwhacking down to uh, some shut-ins. And uh, I decided since it's early enough, it's only 8.30 and I'm uh, up and on the trail, that I'm going to do the uh, rest of this Bell Mountain Loop. I haven't been on this trail in, oh, 15 years, maybe. so. I'm uh, looking forward to seeing the back half of the loop uh, before I get back to the parking lot. Uh, the stars last night were truly amazing. One of the darkest sky uh, sights I've seen in some time. As a matter of fact, uh, I think Texas was probably the last time I've seen the Milky Way as uh, good as I have seen it, uh, as good as I saw it last night. It was a uh, great night. The uh, temperature last night got down to be 28, uh, so it was cool, but I was comfortable, and it uh, is only supposed to uh, get down to the 40s tonight, so that's quite, uh, quite uh, good and very warm. High is supposed to be uh, 60 today, so we'll uh, mosey on down the trail, and if anything comes up, we will uh, check back in. Thanks for coming along. That might be kind of hard to see, but there's the trail on the ridge going up, 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 up that I just fell off the backside of Bell Mountain. So, getting down into the creek area, but uh, it's been downhill for the last hour. Joe's Creek, and down in the valley of Bell Mountain, has plenty of water in it. A little creek obstacle, Joe's Creek crosses the trail, shouldn't be uh, too much problem, shouldn't uh, have to get wet, and we don't. Back up on top again. I knew I'd have to pay for that uh, elevation decrease down into the creek area sooner or later, and I did. 
it was uh, straight up. This is supposed to be accessible to horses, but uh, there were so many blowdowns, I don't see how uh, a horse would have made it up or around those blowdowns coming up that hill. I didn't but, film yeah. going up because it wasn't pretty, because it was old man walking, but uh, it was nice to be on top again. Hopefully I'll stay this way until I join the Ozark Trail again, and uh, then it's definitely all downhill from there. Well, anyway, it's an absolutely beautiful day, as you can see, probably in the low 50s right now. A cool breeze, but low 50s, and uh, just a great day to walk. So, I'm enjoying being out here. Uh, as I was sitting here resting and enjoying myself, this uh, reminded me, as I think I said before, that I haven't been on this trail probably in 15 years. So I wanted to give a shout out to my uh, bestest hiking partner, Christine Hoyer. Uh, I miss you on the trails, and uh, this, bring back, this brings back a lot of fond memories. So thanks very much for getting me back into backpacking, um, and good luck in the Smoky Mountains where you are now. So made it back to the end of the loop. So uh, 8.40, 9.40, 20, 40, 30, 40, 1 hour 40 minutes for uh, about 5 miles. Pretty good. Didn't seem like that, although there were a couple ups and downs. So back at the, back at the Y in the trail. And I'm going to head back the other way, back to the parking lot. So about uh, two and a half miles straight down off the mountain. A giant Karen on the way up to the top of Bell Mountain. Somebody's handiwork stacking all the granite together to make a marker. Back up on the Ozark Trail, heading back down to the parking lot. The familiar OT sign that'll follow me uh, through Bell Mountain Wilderness. So, finally off the Bell Mountain Loop. Yeah. Ozark Trail in that direction. Bell Mountain Trail in that direction. And parking lot is only a couple hundred yards away. Uh, this was really a memorable hang, a uh, memorable night. Uh, one, because of the weather. I don't think I can ever remember a November weekend being so nice during the day and so mild at night. Uh, the stars last night were spectacular. Uh, more than I've seen in quite some time. Makes me uh, long for the old uh, astronomy days being out all night. The uh, morning sunrise was beautiful. Glad I got up to see the whole thing. The company was really good. We had a few firsts. Gideon's son, Jack, his first night in a hammock. He took to it, of course, like a fish in the water. Just a super young man. Uh, honey bear and spider, well, they struggled getting up to the top of Bell Mountain, but they made it. They arrived later, but that just made uh, their company uh, all the more sweeter for having uh, made such a great effort to get up to the campsite and spend it with us. Uh, also, this area brought back a lot of fond memories. Uh, reminiscing about hiking with Christine uh, and, all the, uh, and all the hikes we've done in between. So uh, I must say that this has just been a super, super weekend. So I'm looking forward to uh, talking to uh, a lot of these folks again. Hair Bear uh, is going to do the Appalachian Trail, and uh, I'm looking forward to uh, talking to him about uh, some sections and uh, any help I can provide. But uh, um, all in all, just a super day, a super time. So thanks for coming along. It was really enjoyable.